Greetings everybody, this is Devar with Carob Sensations, back at you with another recipe. This time, what we're going to do is a variation of a smoothie slash yogurt type of protein rich, nutrient dense recipe that I like to have in the morning. So, first thing, what we're going to start with is we're going to get all our fruits. Right here, you have about two cups of strawberries and one cup of mango. We're going to go ahead and get this thrown right into the blender. We have about a half a cup of pineapple and three-fourths of a cup of blueberries. We have a quarter teaspoon of hemp powder and two tablespoons of chia seeds. We have four pitted dates and one thumb of ginger. And last but not least, two tablespoons of sea moss gel. Now, if you haven't seen my video on how to make sea moss gel, go ahead and click right here, and then you'll go ahead and get that. Let's go ahead and put this in. Now, we're gonna add some apple juice. Just find any organic apple juice. Make sure that when you turn the back and you read the ingredients, there's only one word on there. It should say apples. If it says anything else, it's not apple juice. So let's go ahead and pour this in here. All right, let's go ahead and give this a blend. Now that we have everything blended up, let's go ahead and mix the cream that we're going to put on top. The first ingredient that we have is one half cup of coconut cream. Now, the way you make coconut cream is you take the thick mature coconut meat and you run it through a juicer. Once you run it through the juicer, you're going to get that thick creamy um, coconut cream that I'm talking about. Now you're going to use that for this ingredient. Then you're going to take two tablespoons of coconut butter and add to the coconut cream. So let's go ahead and do that. Now we have our coconut butter added to our coconut cream. What we're going to do is add one tablespoon of maple syrup. Now this particular maple syrup we got when we went on a trip to Pennsylvania and we actually saw them harvest this right out of the tree. Now we're going to add some blueberries in here. And continue mixing. Now you just want to mix it together. You don't want to break up the blueberries. Because if you do break up the blueberries, then you're going to change the color. Now we're going to scoop out some of our smoothie. Put it right in our glass and then we build this masterpiece. Now let's go ahead and add our cream right on the top. And then we garnish with a little bit more blueberries. And there you have it guys, finished product. Our fruit smoothie with the coconut cream garnished with some blueberries on top. Very simple, very easy to make, and you're gonna enjoy it. My favorite part of every video is this moment right here where I get to taste it. But first, let's get a little closer look on there before I go ahead and um, devour this. Can you see it? It looks good. Let me back up. Moment of truth. Mm. Mm. Amazing. Amazing. Sorry. Guys, remember, with all of the fruits that we use in this recipe, they have to be frozen. Whether you buy them frozen or you freeze them yourself, make sure they're frozen when you put them in the blender because you want that smoothie-like consistency. Now, 
As I always say, if you like this recipe, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Like us on Facebook. Check us out on Instagram. We're always posting different recipes and things that we do there. Log on to our website for different articles and things that we have coming up. And just feel free to leave a comment below and let me know what you think. As we always say, peace and love and I appreciate everything. Thank you for all the great comments that you guys have left. All the positive feedback. All the positive energy coming our way. We really appreciate it. And I will see you next time. Blend up with carrot with the lettuce in a juice No free free mix with vegetable with the fruits And give me a bottle of spirulina And make me mix up the roots with me Um, and if you have any questions, go ahead Feel free to leave a comment Like us on Facebook <coughs> I think a blueberry <laughs> stuck <coughs> Greetings everybody, this is Devar with Carob Sensations and I'm back at you with another recipe. This time what we're going to do is, what we call this? What is this?